the whole city series Cigars and citrus sevens, black cement threes, fours The hairs and bread elevens No doubt that I'll be wearing some fire at any sighting With these door and becker fives you can see me in any lighting It's exciting, I'll be flexing to the coldest degree What's up everybody, it's Sneakerhead M Checks I know my YouTube channel is all about sneakers but since Travis Scott creates so much hype in the sneaker community, I felt like a McDonald's Travis Scott meal review was relevant. <laughs> so me and JB took a trip to our local McDonald's to try it out. I want to check McDonald's and Travis. Especially you, Travis. Them ugly ass jean shorts. You need to cut it out. <laughs> big ass M on the butt. Like, what, what are you doing? Bro? What are you doing? Hi, do you guys have the Travis Scott meal? Yes. Alright, um, what comes on the burger? The, the burger comes ketchup, onions, pickles, uh, comes uh, bacon, cheese. Alright, um, can I have the Travis Scott meal, but no cheese and no pickles? Right. I'm using the, the, the strawberry cheese. Yeah. With no ice cream. Gotta get the no ice cream. Is it like a Travis Scott Happy Meal version? No? Uh, so Y'all got the toys? <laughs> no, we don't have the toys, but this is different. Well, it's not Travis Scott. It's not Travis. Yeah. How's Travis Scott fries? Is that it, bro? It tastes like regular Travis. It tastes like regular McDonald's French fries. I'm really, I'm really gonna see how the burger. All right, here we go. Here's the moment. Okay. Travis Scott burger with the M checks feature because there's no cheese and no uh, pickles. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I give it a thumbs up, you know. We do. <laughs> Steve, how you feel? Oh, uh. <laughs> Drivers, that shit was high. I ain't had McDonald's in like two years. It was, it was worth it. One thing I gotta say though, the food, listen, the food is good. But one thing I'm disappointed in is the lack of like, Paraphernalia in the store? Exactly. Thank you. That was the word I was looking for. You're like, welcome. First of all, in the store, they didn't have any kind of Travis decoration. I know it's like the, the second day, but I was gonna have like a Travis Scott, you know, cutout figure in there, something like that, and they did it. But like, even like, look, the cups, just a regular McDonald's cup. You know, there's no like, you know, they they, they gotta they should have put like Cactus Jack or something on this, you know. All yeah, of this stuff could have been mad, like Travis Scott, you know, themed. Like they could have put the Cactus Jack thing on there, the little, you know, something. They could have did a lot of stuff. I'm not even, I, you know, I could go on and on about how they could have been creative. With it. Bottom line, the meal is good. So for those of y'all wondering, like, you know, is it worth the hype? I'm gonna say yes. Besides the fact that they could have did way better, like advertising in the store and on the cartons and on the, um, the bag. The bag, yeah, the bag too. Like yeah. they could have went crazy on the bag. Like I'm just thinking of some of the stuff that I saw in the merch, like some of the designs. If they would have put that on the bag, on the cup, like it would be resellable. Yeah, I don't think I'm none saying. of this is, will be resellable. Yeah, you know what's crazy? Because. I guess that's why they didn't want to make the card yeah, resellable. Like, look, they could have had this symbol on the bag. That's what I'm saying. Like that cactus jack. They could have had that on the bag. They put it on everything. All his merch is always cactus jack or something like that. And you're telling me they made all this hype around the McDonald's collab. And there's no Cactus Jack here. There's no Cactus Jack here. But look, I'm, I'm really just being picky right now because, you know, when it comes to, like, hype stuff like that, you know, like, we, we want those details. We think those details are crazy. I'm going to give them the benefit of the doubt because it's the second day, maybe by next week, whenever. They'll probably eventually have some advertisement. Or there's probably other stores with more advertising. Like, definitely in Houston and stuff like that, I'm sure they're going crazy. I can't believe they did have the toy for the Happy Man. Like, what was the point? What was the point of having this shit? Don't Travis Scott's name. Nothing, nothing that, you know, signifies that as Travis Scott, except the receipt. Which is cool. Honestly, and I, and I, I dropped know. the receipt back there, actually. If it was trash, I would've kept it. Y'all know I keep it G. When the pair of sneakers is trash, I'll let y'all know these ain't it. And if this wasn't it, I would've let y'all know too, but I'm not gonna lie, it isn't. See, my plan was, we gonna go cop an extra Travis Scott meal, go to round two and sell it there. So yeah, we gotta, I'm playing. Listen, all jokes aside, don't be the bozo to try to resell. I'm for real. Don't, do not be the bozo to try to sell this meal. It's a funny joke. It's a cool thought and idea, but don't, don't come on. It's food. By the time you even post it, the fries gonna be cold. This is over. Don't like. I heard they did that with the Popeyes chicken sandwich. Yo, I'm telling you, somebody gotta do the meat mill meal. That's a tongue twister, but it'd be fire. Let Wendy's do it. I'm pulling up. I'm in the video this time. Josh is gonna record. Milk.
Fab or Meek Mill meal at a restaurant. But until then, Travis Scott, get the thumbs up. Um, thank you everybody for watching. If you eat McDonald's, I suggest you go try this. I normally say subscribe to my channel for more videos like this, but I don't know when the next time I'll be reviewing a meal is. But um, you know, for early sneaker reviews and sneaker related content, subscribe to my channel and turn those video notifications on. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time.